Giovanni Arrighi, the 7th of July 1937 to the 18th of June 2009, was an Italian economist, sociologist and world systems analyst from 1998 a professor of sociology at Johns Hopkins University. His work has been translated into over 15 languages. Topic Biography Arrighi was born in Milan, Italy in 1937. He received his laurea in economics from the Bocconi University in 1960. Arrighi began his career teaching at the University College of Rhodesia now Zimbabwe and later at the University College of Dar es Salaam in Tanzania. During this period he developed arguments about how the labor supply and labor resistance affected the development of colonialism and national liberation movements. It was there that he met Emanuel Wallerstein, later a collaborator on a number of research projects. After returning to Italy in 1969, Arrighi and others formed the Gruppo Gramsci in 1971. In 1979 Arrighi joined Wallerstein and Terence Hopkins as a professor of sociology at the Fernand Braudel Center for the Study of Economies, Historical Systems, and Civilizations at Binghamton University. It was during this time that the Fernand Braudel Center became known as the main center of world systems analysis, attracting scholars from all over the world. His most famous work was a trilogy on the origins and transformations of global capitalism, which began in 1994 with a book that reinterpreted the evolution of capitalism, the long 20th century, money, power, and the origins of our times. The book is a classic in the field, published in at least ten languages. Giovanni completed a second edition of the long 20th century in 2009. In 1999, he published Chaos and Governance in the Modern World System with Beverly Silver, and in 2007, he published Adam Smith in Beijing, Lineages of the 21st Century, comparing Western and East Asian economic development and exploring China's rise as an economic world power. Although in many ways intellectually close to Emanuel Wallerstein, Arrighi tends to ascribe greater significance to the recent shift in economic power to East Asia. He also emphasized his debt to Adam Smith, Max Weber, Karl Marx, Antonio Gramsci, Karl Polanyi and Joseph Schumpeter. Arrighi died in his home in Baltimore on June 18, 2009. He had been diagnosed with cancer in July 2008. He is survived by his wife and partner in scholarship, Professor Beverly Silver, and his son Andrea Arrighi. A retrospective interview by David Harvey on his intellectual trajectory, The Winding Paths of Capital, was published in the March-April 2009 issue of New Left Review. Topic. Works Monographs 1967 The Political Economy of Rhodesia 1973 Essays on the Political Economy of Africa 1978 Geometry of Imperialism 1982 Dynamics of Global Crisis 1985 Semi-Peripheral Development, The Politics of Southern Europe in the Twentieth Century 1989 Antisystemic Movements 1990 Transforming the Revolution, Social Movements and the World System with Samir Amin, Andre Gunder Frank and Emanuel Wallerstein 1994 – The Long Twentieth Century – Money, Power, and the Origins of Our Times 1999 – Chaos and Governance in the Modern World System with Beverly J. Silver 
2003 The Resurgence of East Asia, 500, 150 and 50 Year Perspectives 2007 Adam Smith in Beijing, Lineages of the 21st Century Review of Adam Smith in Beijing, Elvin, Mark, July August 2008. The Historian as Harrispex. New Left Review. New Left Review. 2 52, Journal Articles and Book Chapters since 2001. Workers North and South. With B.J. Silver in C. Lays and L. Panic, eds. The Socialist Register, 2001. London: The Merlin Press, 2000. Reprinted, abridged in L. Moore, ed. The Global Resistance Reader. London and New York: Routledge, 2005. Broadle, Capitalism and the New Economic Sociology. Review, 24, 1, 2001. Capitalist Development in World Historical Perspective. With Jason W. Moore. In R. Albritton, Emma Toe, R. Westra, A. Zuege, Eds, Phases of Capitalist Development, Booms, Crises and Globalization. London, Macmillan, 2001. Capitalism and World Disorder, with B. J. Silver, Review of International Studies, 27, 2001. Global Capitalism and the Persistence of the North South Divide, Science and Society, LXIV, 4, 2001. The African Crisis, World Systemic and Regional Aspects. New Left Review. New Left Review. 2 15. May to June 2002. Lineages of Empire. Historical Materialism 10, 3, 2002. Reprinted in G. Balakrishnan, ed. Debating Empire. London and New York, Verso, 2003. Industrial Convergence, Globalization, and the Persistence of the North-South Divide. Studies in Comparative International Development 38-1 with B.J. Silver and B.D. Brewer. Response. Studies in Comparative International Development 38-1 with B.J. Silver and B. D. Brewer. The Social and Political Economy of Global Turbulence. New Left Review. New Left Review. 2, 20. March to April 2003. Kindai Sekai Shisutam no Keisei to Henyu ni Akeru Hegemonai Koka no Yakuari. The Role of Hegemonic States in the Formation and Transitions of the Modern World System. In T. Matsuda and S. Akita, eds. Hegemonai Koka to Sekai Shisutam, Hegemonic States and the Modern World System. Tokyo, Yamakawa Publishing Company, 2002. Historical Capitalism East and West. With P. K. Hui, H. Hung, and M. Selden. In G. Arigi, T. Hamashita and M. Selden, eds. The Resurgence of East Asia, 500, 150 and 50 Year Perspectives. London and New York, Routledge, 2003. Global Inequalities and the Legacy of Dependency Theory. Radical Philosophy Review 5 to 1 minus 2, 2002, 2003. Polanyi's Double Movement: The Bell's Epochs of British and U.S. Hegemony Compared. With B.J. Silver, Politics and Society 31 to 2, 2003. Il Lungo XX Secolo, Una Replica. Contemporanea 6 to 4, 2003. Poser Hegemony Army Zahodnimi, with I Ahmed and M. Shi. 
Lewinoga 15, 2003. Hegemony and anti systemic movements. In I. Wallerstein, ed., The Modern World System in the Long Durry. Boulder, Colorado, Paradigm Publishers, 2004. Globalization in World Systems Perspective. In R. Applebaum and W. Robinson, eds., Critical Globalization Studies. New York and London, Routledge, 2005. Hegemony Unraveling 1. PDF. New Left Review. New Left Review. 2. 32. March to April 2005. Hegemony Unraveling 2. PDF. New Left Review. New Left Review. 2. 33. May to June 2005. Rough Road to Empire. In F. Tabak, ed., Allies as Rivals, the U.S., Europe, and Japan in a Changing World System. Boulder, Colorado, Paradigm Press, 2005. States, Markets and Capitalism, East and West. In M. Miller, ed., Worlds of Capitalism. Institutions, Economic Performance, and Governance in the Era of Globalization. London, Routledge, 2005. Industrial Convergence and the Persistence of the North-South Industrial Divide, a Rejoinder. With Beverly J. Silver and Benjamin D. Brewer. Studies in Comparative International Development, Summer 2005, in Press. The World Economy and the Cold War, 1970-1990. In Melvin P. Leffler and Odd Arne Westad, eds., The Cambridge History of the Cold War, Vol. 3, Endings, pp. 23–44. Cambridge, Cambridge University Press. 2010. ISBN 978 0 See also World Systems Theory Topic External Links Johns Hopkins Homepage Archived July 19, 2011 at the Wayback Machine Video on Giovanni Arrighi, David Harvey, and Joel Andreas, on Arrighi's Adam Smith in Beijing 2008. Article on Giovanni Arrighi, in memoriam, by Tom Reefer Giovanni Arrighi, Systemic Cycles of Accumulation, Hegemonic Transitions, and the Rise of China by William I. Robinson.